the government have opened negotiations with Roman Abramovich's advisers over the terms of the sale of Chelsea, which Downing Street is eager to push through as quickly as possible. American bank The Rain Group paused the sale after Abramovich was sanctioned on Thursday, but there are numerous bidders willing to pay over £2 billion for the club, if the Russian agrees to terms dictated by the government. The government regard a quick sale as the best outcome for Chelsea and its fans, but for that to happen Abramovich would have to agree to writing off loans of over £1.5 billion without receiving any of the proceeds. The government are ready to grant a special license to the Rain Group to complete the sale, although they would retain oversight of the process and are likely to demand that all the money raised be given away to charities linked to Ukraine. Abramovich's thinking is difficult to discern as he has altered his tactics numerous times since Russia invaded Ukraine two weeks ago. His initial plan to hand of the running of the club to the Chelsea Foundation collapsed within 48 hours due to objections raised by the trustees and the charity foundation. While his rare publicly statement in which he expressed willingness to donate net proceeds of the sale to victims of the war has been vetoed by the government and the club is no longer his to sell, Abramovich has always denied being a close associate of Vladimir Putin, and won damages in the High Court case last year after contesting claim that he was instructed to buy Chelsea by the Russia president to gain influence in the West. So may view accepting the government's conditions of sale as an admission of guilt. His options are limited however, as refusing to accept the government's terms would condemn Chelsea to financial collapse and damage his legacy at a club he claims to hold dear. Chelsea are currently prohibited from seeking a sale due to the terms of the special license they are operating under after Abramovich was sanctioned, but the government have indicated they would be prepared to alter the terms to permit a sale if they receive an application from the club. It is unclear what timescale they are working to, although the 15 March deadline set by the Rain Group for initial bids last week appears to be no longer relevant.